we start with one of our charts. Just I want to give a quick update. First of all, if you refer to our analysis in my last video when the price was within this move, we mentioned the way is dropping, we can expect the price drop some more, but if we get the reversal, we can look for buy. As we can see, the price drop, there was no trade setup either for buy or sell. And now we want to see what we get here. For any trade, we have to look for correct trade setup, either buy or sell. Simply, we cannot buy, okay? And now first, we start with higher time frame. If we refer to our analysis, we mentioned in my last video, we mentioned we can expect the price to turn to, a, I mean, give us more complex correction before we get the reversal anyway. We don't have any new information based on daily chart and this is what i mean by price can consolidate here for a longer time as you can see the price drop no one the only thing is because of the sharp move the price drop because of the news note we can look for this one as a different way because because when we look at this if based on forward chart we get this reversal and one more drop what i can see here is still we can get one move up turn to a flat before we get the one more drop what I want to see is that bit on forward chart. If the price from here doesn't break the previous low, because if the price drop and we test the previous low, at least here, any reversal from here, we can look for the start of the up move. But if the price reverse from here, we can look for the internal for that, then we can get one more drop. This is the reason why I mentioned the price can consolidate here for longer time. This means all it depends on what we get here. For sure, if we want to look for buy, any reversal from here, we will be more interested. Because even if this the price gives us a correction for continuation, we are going to sell at the lowest price of this correction. Okay? In this case, this is how we can explain based on forward chart. But if I move to one hour chart, we see the different things. Because right now, we can see this one. Okay, how about if this is the start of the up move and this is the correction as a flat? That's mean we can get one more up. As of what we explain based on forward forward chart, that's mean what we can see based on forward chart and the one hour chart is really different. One hour chart, it can give us more complex. That's mean, as I explained, still we can explain similar to what I explained based on forward chart. Any reversal from here, without breaking the previous slow, we consider as this one. It can give us one more up with a breakout of 2.2 to give us one more drop before we get the reversal. This is the reasons why I explain it can turn to a more complex correction. And the best thing is if the price drop from here confirmed the, to the, this move is finished with the breakout of the previous low, then from there any reversal we can look for long term trade. Okay, the reasons I mentioned the, these two cases is the if we want to look for trade, at least we should know what we're looking for. Again, if we want to look for, buy, I mean, trade, the best thing is if we get any reversal. That's why when the price was within this move, I mentioned if we get a buy, trade setup for buy, we will take the trade. That means if we get any buy from here, any reversal, in terms of the risk and reward can give us good trade setup. And we know we're looking for the breakout of 2.2. But how about if the price start to correct here as a correction for one more drop? Then do we need to look for sell or not? Because at that time, we are selling at the lowest price of the, this correction. And the, what we can expect, we want to see the breakout of the previous low, which is almost, if I remove everything, 1.33. Okay, which trade are we looking for? Because we cannot confirm if the price drop, how deep it can go. We can put over FIP, but that one is approximate. It doesn't give us a really good value. That's why I mentioned any reversal we are more interested rather than we look for sell. The only times we can look for sell if this one turns up to really deep correction, we can look for trade setup because if it gives us a small correction for one more drop, the only way is to have in triple of this, which we are not going to sell at the lowest price of this correction. That's why if he wants to look for sell, the best thing is if this one turns to a deeper correction. And right now, what I want to see is that if we get the reversal, we will take the trade. And this is what we're looking for. That's why we mentioned we can look for this flat for one move up, at least turn to more complex correction. It doesn't mean the price come here have to drop. What I wanna say is that if we get any reversal, we will take it. And with a breakout of 2.2, if there is a continuation, we keep. If not, we take the trade, then we can expect to get one more drop. All right, that's me right now. 
and irreversal traits that are for buy, we will be more interested to look for buy. And again, it doesn't mean the price cannot drop. Still, we can expect the price to drop even break the previous low. But in terms of the risk and reward, we will be more interested to look for buy. For sell, we have to see the trade setup then from there we make a decision. In this case, we just follow the chart and we see how, if I see any update, I will share. And even if we move to 15 minutes, this is what we get here. All right, this means we don't have any trade setup for sell yet. Okay, but we are whatever we are explaining, explaining based on one hour chart. It's not based on 15 minute chart. Anyway, we just follow the chart and again, we're looking for buy. That's why when the price was within this move, I was mentioning let the price drop some more before we look for reversal. Okay, that's why I mentioned we cannot buy within this range. We do trade setup. This is exactly what we get. And right now, if we want to look for buy, wait for the reversal, we take the trade. In this case, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.